all right y'all unfortunately i ran into a little bit of problems my elgato crashed down in the middle of my recording and i didn't realize it until like 20 minutes into the recording okay i'm gonna have two videos okay this video i'm gonna have a short explanation of what happened throughout those 20 minutes because i don't want to include it without face cam you know i'm gonna have a short explanation short synopsis of those 20 minutes and then i'm gonna go and pick up where i started up my camera again i'm gonna have a link in the description the top link the top link is going to be the full version now it's going to be edited still even the minutes i didn't have my face cam i still edited them but it's just going to have those you know 20 minutes of of gameplay that y'all not going to see the full thing of i'm going to just give y'all a short synopsis well on the link in the description it's going to be the full thing it's going to have that short person and it's going to have the ending too so uh watch either one which is the one you want sorry for that it's not gonna happen again hopefully i really couldn't do nothing about it but yeah enjoy bro after creating our new character we were immediately thrown into the story of stardew valley we start as a child looking out on our grandpa who's laying in bed with the special note in his hand for us as we take the letter he tells us not to open it and leaves it with this message there will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life and your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. When that happens, my boy, you'll be ready for this gift. I like that. The next scene, we're shown working at our office job, many years later, for a company called Joja. We open up our desk drawer to see that same letter Grandpa had given us so long ago. It reads, If you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I lost sight of what mattered most in life real connections with other people in nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I've been close to D to that place, my pride and joy, Sensei Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This is my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my boy. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? As soon as we hop off the bus to Stardew Valley, we're greeted by Robin, the local carpenter sent by Mayor Lewis to welcome us to Stardew Valley. We're taken to our farm. It's a bit overgrown, a little rustic, but it has great soil for us to farm on. We sleep the night in our cabin and wake up to a gift from Mayor Lewis, 15 parsnip seeds. On our first day, we planted some of our seeds and we met some of the people of the town. Ooh, never mind, new person right here. What's up, y'all? What's up, big dog? This is Shane. Cool luck. I don't know me. Bro, what's your- We got Gus. Well, hello there. I'm Gus. Chef and owner of the Star Drop Saloon. Or Salon. Whatever you said. We got Marnie. Ah, Mayor Lewis told me you just arrived. I'm Marnie. What's up, Marnie? Oh, that's right. I heard someone new was moving into that old farm. Can I meet multiple times? I sell livestock and animal care products at my ranch. You should swing by sometime. Alright, Marnie. What's up? Um, it's kind of- Wait, what'd she, what'd she say? What'd she say? Oh, okay. So you can only click it once. Um, let's talk to this dude. Hey, it's Mr. Ty, new farmer. I'm Pierre, owner of the local general store. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is the place to go. I'll also buy produce from you for a good price. Okay. A little agriculture could really inject new life into the local economy. Very cool. We got Alex over here, little football star. So you're the new guy, huh? Cool. I'll see you around. All right. Cool. Uh, oh, we just in a crib like this. Okay. It's oh, irritating no. to have to meet all these new people, huh? Name's George, by the way. Now buzz off. Why, hello, and welcome to our little community, dear. What's up, Evelyn? You can call me Granny if you like. We got Pam. Hey, kid, the name's Pam. What's up with you? Don't be a jerk, and we'll get along fine. That's cool enough. That's cool enough, you know? This is Emily. Oh, hi. Or, oh, I can read it on your face. You're gonna love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. Vincent. Oh, a stranger. My name's Vincent. Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. Jody. Oh, you aren't exactly how I imagined. Let me stop. <laughs> you aren't exactly how I imagined, but that's okay. I'm Jody. That's Haley. Oh, you're the new farmer boy, aren't you? That's it? You're taking pictures? Haley's too involved with their camera to notice you. That's wild. I'm right in front of you, dog. <gasps> yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hold on, hold on. Bro, my Elgato crashed, bro? Crashed? Luckily, we ain't do too much. It was really just meeting some people, bro. Let's just keep going, bro. I'm kind of mad, bro. I'm kind of mad. That's, dang, that's annoying. Whatever. We're going to go back and uh, meet some people up. Meet some more people. 
some empty crops and stuff around here, but there's no like, you know what I mean? Oh, there's a sewer down here. And it's locked, okay. Bro, where am I at, bro? I am completely lost. I thought I was heading back to the place I just came from, but I definitely got sidetracked, I guess. I'm kinda just following the wind, whoever it takes me. Oh, Haley. Can you talk to me now or are you still too focused on your camera? Huh? Oh, I'm Haley. Hmm, if we're You see, that's that's crazy, cause like, what are you doing in this farm town? Expecting me as a farmer not to be wearing my farmer overalls, bro. I am a farmer, bro. Like I really do you wanna go and see my crops? They're planted, bro. Talk about if you weren't if you weren't for those horrendous clothes, you might be actually cute. Shut up. Shut up. Nobody likes you, Haley. Stop it. That's your camera, bro. I never want to talk to you. Let's go. I can't even leave right here. I gotta walk by her again, bro. <laughs> Don't look at me. Oh, we gotta go to the Stop it, bro. Stop it. Run past her. Run past her. Yup. <laughs> Showing them legs. Showing the burners. Come on. Let's meet some new people, bro. Because Haley really tried to hold me right there. I'm not ugly. Stop playing with me. She didn't see the glasses. She didn't see the, see the easy gang on her. Stop it. Alright. Somebody else down here. Elliot. Oh, that's not what I expected. Okay. New farmer we've all been expecting. And... His arrival sparked many a conversation. I'm Elliot. <laughs> I'm not going. <laughs> I live in a little cabin by the beach. <laughs> it's a pleasure to meet you. <laughs> I feel like that's how he talks. <laughs> this is his crib. The cabin by the beach. It's like only Elliot's friends can enter uninvited. Okay. That's what's up. Good stuff. Good stuff. What is this? A, a dock? A boat dock? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Gone fishing. I'll be back tomorrow. The one? Okay, good stuff. So you get, get to make your money? Okay. Or right. put some food on the table? All right. Elliot, what's good, my boy? Loki look bad, fresh. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> oh, this is Mayor Lewis's crib. So, how's your first night in the old cottage? That's it? Your grandpa used to complain about the rickety old bed, but I think deep down he actually loved that house. I mean, probably, dude. He said it was his pride and joy. So this is Mayor Lewis's place. Ooh, what's up with you? What's your name? Maru? Ooh, aren't you the one who moved in? I'm Maru. I've been looking forward to meeting you. I don't know why I said like that. Penny. Oh, hello. I'm Penny. That's it. Okay. Maru got anything else to say? You know, with a small town like this, a new face can really alter the community dynamic. It's exciting. <laughs> Let's stop by the saloon, bruh. Somebody said she worked here. Emily. What's this dude talking about? Yo, stop. Who is this? She pregnant? Oh, that's Pan. Never mind. Muffle, muffle, muffle. Gus, we already met him. Never mind. This Shane? Let me see what's up with Shane real quick. Are you done with your attitude, bro? Are you off your period, my boy? Stop it. Talking about some, I don't know you. Why are you talking to me? And he still don't want to talk. That's cool, but I don't want to talk to you either, bro. Uh -huh, I'm heading back here to the. Let me get, snack me a drink, bro. What is this? Can I mine this? Nope. Okay. Ah, music kind of crazy. Ah, all right. It's actually getting kind of late. So I don't think we got much more to do, except call it a call it a night. Who is this? Clint. Oh hi, I'm Clint. What's up, bro? It's locked. Only open from 9 a.m. to 8 p.m. Can we go to the right? We can. We gonna do that tomorrow because it's getting kind of late. We gonna hit the hay. We gotta go back to the crib though. It's actually kind of nice at night, bro. I'm not going to lie. Actually, we're not going to sleep yet. We're going to plant some more. We're going to clear out some space real quick, right? Because we got we bought a bunch of trees and stuff to plant. Or not trees, uh, plants. 
So we're gonna one, two, three, four, five. Is that? Here we go. It's not gonna be super sorted out to start off with. Don't need to though. Three, four, five. Nice. Then let's go ahead and water these up. All right. After we water these up, we'll go ahead and hit the hay, you know? Only so much we could do in a day. Ah. That's all I really had to say. Ah. Let me stop. There we go. We filled the water. Got some fiber. I don't know what we can do with that. There's crafting in this game, isn't there? Hmm. Let's go ahead and sleep for the night. Yes. Okay. Progress has been saved. I like it. Let's go for night number two, bro. The first thing we gotta do is water our plants, you know? We got some mail. We're gonna... Oh, this tree grew. I think that tree grew. I don't remember this tree being here blocking my vision. Right? I think so. Let's go ahead and water up our plants, though. This music is kind of, you know? I like this music, but the soundtrack is cool. Haha. <laughs> I'm vibing to it, for sure, for sure. All right, let's check this mail. What does it say? Advertisement. I keep finding cool stuff, but my backpack is full. Does this sound like you? Well, Pierre's got you covered. Dude, I was just at your crib yesterday, bro. He said, stop by Pierre's general store today and check out the affordable size 24 backpack. I actually do need that, I'm not gonna lie. Let's say this again, hello there. Just got back from a fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you. Willie, you got your Willie for me, bro? Oh, your name is Willie. Heard you. Okay. Let me check the journal. Let me check the journal. To the beach. Visit the beach south of town before 5 p.m. Where about I do that right now? Maru was kind of cool. Is there? I'm pretty sure there is a little relationship type of thing to this, bro. Maru kind of cool. Maru kind of cool. Penny kind of cool. Haley. Let me not say it, bro. You know what Haley is, bro. <laughs> we don't rock with them around here. You feel me? Let me go down south of the beach, or south of the town, towards the beach. That's this way, right? By Elliot's house, yep. This is where we met Elliot the first time. Now we're going down. I'm assuming Willie's the fisher, fisherman. Let's go. Oh, a cutscene. <laughs> it's gonna come me off guard. Ahoy there, son. What's good? Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet you. Ah, I'm still trying to unwind from a month out in the salty seas. Twas a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. That's what's up. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. Okay. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. That's a smart thing. Get him into fishing, he buys from your shop. That's smart, that's smart. Can't knock it. I received a bamboo pole. That shit gonna snap. Stop it. Appreciate it though, Willie. There's a good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. Okay, that's cool. Is there fish at my place? I think there is. Excuse me. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now. So come by if you need supplies. I'll also buy you anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. <laughs> that's my old. That's what my old pappy used to say. Anyway. Okay. You gonna teach me how to fish, bro? Cause I do not remember, bro. There we go, bamboo pole. Oh yeah. Wait, what the hell? Oh, we gotta click to rate. I remember this, I remember this, I remember this. I remember this, this is weird, bro. It's kind of cool though. I'm not gonna lie. You gotta click to hold the bar in the middle of the. You feel me? In, inside of the. Keep the fish inside of the bar by clicking to raise the bar and letting go to let the bar go down. If that makes sense. Didn't mean to hit my mic either. We're gonna do this one more time. One more time. There we go. 
So we caught two fish. We had an anchovy, five inches. Oh, we have to throw something out. Hold on. Let me throw out these big seeds. Okay. So I can sell something to Willie? Oh, hey there. It's nice to see young folk moving into the valley. It's not very common these days. I can assume, bro. No, nah, stop it. It's locked open from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. So I'm like, oh, it's going to be open real soon. Should I wait? Nah. Yeah, I'm going to wait. You need someone to get my water. <laughs> bro, daily reminder, bro. Drink you some water. Some water. You know what I mean? Drink some water, bro. Why not? It's not going to hurt you. You know what I mean? All right, let's go ahead and sell these two fish we caught back to Willie. Anchovy for 30 and sunfish for 30. Okay. Sorry about the smell. Don't worry about it, boss. Why are we holding that rock like that? Like, we a little kid. Like, mommy, mommy, look. I found a rock. I found a rock. What's your name? Jazz? Da, da, da. Hi. <laughs> All right, we still gotta meet some more people. Okay, 21 out of 20. Oh, really? So we met 21 out of 28 people. So we haven't gone right yet. That's where I wanna go. Oh, it's not like we following. Hold on, bro. Just gotta keep a little bit back. Come on now. We're gonna run by, we're gonna run by. Let's go. let's check out this place right here, this library thing. Yep, library. This dude, Gunther, hello there. Oh, this is an archeological office. Uh, this is embarrassing, but the previous curator made off with the entire collection. We don't have any artifacts to display. But I'm hoping to remedy that soon. Hey, if you find any artifacts and minerals out there, would you let me know? Okay. I'm down, bro. Anytime. Wait, did I just meet him? No, we didn't. So, we can't talk to him like... Like regular person? That's cool. We can't really talk to him? That's crazy. Okay. I think we already met these people. This is Penny, Vincent, and Jazz. Yep. Well, she's tutoring. Miss Penny says I have to read this book before I can go play. Read up, my boy. That's what's up, Penny. Uh, a tutor? That's you for me. Teaching the youth. That's a great thing, bro. <laughs> that, that sitting animation goes kind of crazy. All right. Where else can we go? What is this? Abomination of a place. Let's see. Who's this? Clint. Oh, we already met Clint. Never mind. So this is a what? A weaponsmith shop. We can buy coal, iron, copper, and gold. We can upgrade tools. Ooh. Okay. Excuse me. Can we go further? Yes, we can. What's up here? Have we met her? That Pam? That's not Pam. This is Pam. Okay. Whoa. Why are you so mad? Sorry. I gotta be cautious with strangers. Yo, I didn't read what you said. Joja Market. No, no, sir. That's where we used to work at. Not Joja Market, but we work for Joja. Joja Cola? Yeah. I'm already seeing where this is going, bro. It's some crazy, some crazy stuff with Joja, man. We gotta go up now. We gotta go up and meet some new people. Because, yeah, I went over here, went this path, nothing left for me to see. It's music, bro. kind of cool <laughs> it's kind of cool all right did we water our plants today i think we did what is this it's the mayor's house no the mayor's downstairs downstairs down south it's locked okay it's a little garden there see what she on bro what do you want bro what do you want what do you want nice shoes why is she always coming disrespectful what is your problem I'm bored, yeah, because you have no friends. Stop it, bro. You see me around here going, not going crazy. Meeting these new people, you feel me? Look at you, sitting alone by the fountain because you're not a friendly person. Nobody wants to spend time with you. How you gonna meet somebody for the first time? You would be cute if your outfit wasn't horrendous. Nice shoes, are those made out of plastic? <laughs> you have no friends, you never will. Not me, sorry. <laughs> bye bye, get him out of here. I think I'm playing with you. I could violate back, but no point. No point. It's just some pixels, bro. Oh, what the? 
Oh, what's good, my what? Uh, Demetrius. Greetings, I'm Demetrius, local scientist and father. Thanks for introducing yourself. I'm studying the local plants and animals from my home laboratory. Have you met my daughter, Maru? She's interested to meet you. I don't know why I'm talking like he's like a mix of like... I don't know, some type of Barack Obama and uh, something. So this Maru crib, okay. This is Maru, this Maru's day? Hell no, that ain't Maru. Who is this? Zane. Sebastian. <laughs> oh, you just moved in, right? Good. Uh, let me, let me, let me stop. He, he seemed cool. Out of all the places you could live. You choose Pelican Town? I know, right? Mm -hmm. girl Haley, she's a, let me check. So one of these is where Maru stay, but uh, she probably, she probably doing something. She probably at work. So we met most people. We haven't met Maru's mom. If her mom is here. You know what I mean? And uh, it's locked. Only Maru's friend can enter uninvited. Okay, my fault, my fault, my fault. I ain't trying to intrude on your privacy, bro. What is this? A railroad. Blocked off. Okay. Who is this? Um, Santa Claus? St. Nick? Um, that's all I got. Linus. Tech tips? <laughs> A stranger? Hello. Don't mind me. I just live out here alone. That's what's up. What the hell is this? Is that a squirrel and a statue with a ruby inside? And we just not gonna be able to investigate that? That's supposed to be normal? Okay, that's what's up. This dude's so cool. Look at him. Look at him standing there. Let me stop, bro. That's Maru. That's Maru. That's Maru Pops, bro. Maru kind of cool. If you know what I mean. You feel me? I don't know, bro. Let me still. Let me chill. Let me chill. Let me chill, bro. I just, you feel me? Why the eyes always got to be on romance, bro? That's not what's important right now. I'm trying to get acquainted with my neighbors. These are my neighbors. I couldn't think. All right. There's five more people I got to meet. I've gone. Where haven't I gone? I went up, left. Left is where I live. I went down. This is up. I remember this place over here. This just this leads back to my house, doesn't it? I think this leads back to my house. Oh, never mind. Oh shit, that scared me. I didn't expect the sound. I don't know why. Is this yeah, this has to be my place. There's a map. There's a whole map, okay. Um, we haven't gone down here, have we? Wizard's Tower. Huh? Question mark, question mark, question mark. Carpenter shop. Community center. How did I miss these things? Where was I just at? Oh. Oh. So Maru is the son of Robin and Demetrius. Robin is the carpenter that introduced us when we first got here. Okay. And Sebastian is Maru's brother? Stepbrother? Twin? Let me chill. They don't look like twins, bro. Mmm. That's real interesting right there. Okay. Okay, so I need to figure out where I have it gone. The mines? I haven't gone there. Question mark? Haven't gone there. Carpenters? I met Robin, Demetrius, Sebastian, Maru. Met them. Community center? I think that was a place that was blocked off. Or locked. Don't know what this is. Backwoods? Bus stop? My farm? Marnie's Ranch, Leah. We haven't met Leah yet. What does Leah look like? I don't remember Leah. Let's go ahead and try and find out. Let me check out the wizard's cottage or whatever that was called. The wizard's place, wizard's tower, and Leah's, Leah's stuff. Can I... Can I see Leah? Just Leah here? It's locked. Okay, this is the, this is like a, a ranch or something. This is Leah's place, I think. I haven't met Leah. Okay. I don't know where she is. She's probably in there. But I can't meet her if I don't see her. Uh, I gotta I gotta figure out what the heck this is. The wizard's tower. What the fuck is that? Over here somewhere. It's um okay, to the left of this. Make our way over this pond and to the left. 
We should find a tower, a wizard's tower. <laughs> Here it is, bro, in all its glory. Let's see what's up. I doubt we're gonna be able to go in. It's probably gonna be like the door is locked. Made all this way out for no reason. Yep, it's locked. You can hear someone inside though. If I bang at your door, you're not gonna you're gonna hear me. Come on. Who haven't we met? Man, I ain't tripping about it. Let me go back to my house. Oh, here it is, here it is, here it is. Here's my seeds. We back at the crib. Nothing in the mail, right? Nope. Right, let's go ahead and refill up our drinks. Drinks, our water. And that's really gonna be it. It's been almost an hour we've been playing. We got introduced to most of the cast, right? 24 out of 28, that's, that's close enough. Y'all didn't enjoy, but it's kind of new. There's something different, bro. Sorry, my, my headphones or my camera didn't work at the start, bro. I don't know what that was. My got to crash midway. I can't do nothing about that. But if y'all did enjoy, make sure y'all like the video, bro. No type of game. Let me know if y'all liked it. If y'all didn't, let me know y'all didn't, bro. You feel me? That's the only way I'm going to know. I appreciate all types of feedback. Positive, negative, whatever y'all want to say, bro. If not, just say what's up in the comments, bro. I'll respond to all my comments. You feel me? Come talk to me down there, bro. I mean, you made it to the end of the video. Why not? Hope y'all have an amazing day, bro. Stay positive. Stay blessed, y'all. We out. Hold on. Let me make sure just in case, bro. Go to sleep and call it a night. It should save my progress. There we go. Nothing crazy happened in the morning. Nobody break into our house. Burglary. We're getting killed. Oh! <gasps> Greatness, I feel amazing. These niggas, they know I made it. They started hating. You famous, started changing. I'm so lame, so you dumb, bitch. I never liked you. Don't speak my name, killer.